Pleasant good morning. How's everybody? Well, I say I saw Mr. Marco Pine's speech and I said, let me box online and do a rebuttal on that. Mr. Marco Pine, how you doing, sir? I hope everything cool, man. Everything cool here, man. Yeah, man. Hey, that speech is powerful, man. You know, most behemoths sit back and say, hey, 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 hey. Boy, look here, Mark Pine came on. I, I, I could be the first to say Mark Pine. Publicly say, man, listen, everything that you said in that speech was the truth. And I realized one thing but the truth. It always sets you free. For the past five years of my life, I've been documenting what's going on in our environment for free. Not because I want to. It's because I love this country. And I was tired of people lying to me, telling me certain things. I caught on the newest. I listen to lies. I call on the newest, I listen to lies. So you know what I do? I buy my equipment, I drive around in Nassau, and I document it myself. Why? Because I know everything that I document is not a lie. Every video, every voicemail that I do is not a lie. And the Bible says the truth will always set you free. The bottom line is, we the citizens of the Commonwealth of Bahamas wants better. And you're right. We voted for better. And we hold this administration up to the highest level to do better. But you're right. If they are not listening to the Bahamian people, the results will be the same. But the question is, who will rise up? and take over because if the PLP didn't do that job then for 2012 the people are mad with the present opposition that's why they are presently in opposition Mr. Deputy while they are mad with the present opposition resulting in them being where they are the people of the Bahamas supporters included of our government are highly disappointed in our performance or the lack thereof. They are no longer as mad with the opposition as they are highly disappointed in us as a government. Before my colleagues chew me to pieces for giving the message that is being permeated out there, beating me up for the truth privately and publicly does not change the perception or reality of what I'm saying. Such dishonorable conduct. The message the people are conveying is that they've seen this movie before. The cast might presently be different, but the plot, scenery, and performance are very vivid and familiar. The Den government would stick their chest out, bang on the deck, laugh at the opposition, and would always remind them, we have the numbers. This is why the people are saying, same movie, different cast. Mr. Deputy, all of us in this honorable place know how that movie ended. 